Okay guys, right through here. Oh my precious baby. Now be careful, her voice may be a little raspy. I'll be back to inform you that visiting hour is over. Hi Lisa, are you awake? Lisa? that? Lisa, it's me, Paris. Your older sister. You gotta remember me, can't you? Sorry. It doesn't ring a bell. Wait. Mom? Mom? I don't remember having kids. What? What do you mean? It's your daughter, Mimi. I'm sorry. Mimi, I don't recognize you. Wait, no, Mom, it's your daughter, Mimi, the one that loves you so, so much. You have to remember me. Please, 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 please remember me, please. I'm really, really sorry. I don't remember you. I, how did I even get here? Lisa, it's Pablo, Paris' servant. I, I, I'm here with Tiffany and, and Paris, your older sister, and your loving, caring daughter, Mimi. How could you not remember us? Ugh. Uh, I'm sorry, but I don't believe I had kids. You must have the wrong person. No, we don't. You're Lisa Monroe. Right? Uh, I believe so. I think. But I don't know any of you. You must have the wrong person. Because I never had kids. I didn't have an older sister. Or a servant. Or... I don't remember, uh, Tiffany, that is. What about Rick and the jewel and all that stuff? You don't remember none of it? Our childhood, mom and dad. I have no idea what you're talking about. I didn't have a sister or some guy named Rick, please. I need to get my rest. Please leave. No, mommy, please. You don't understand. Oh, I understand. That you guys are completely crazy. Now please get out of here. Now. something died in here. Whatever. Lisa, why don't you live a little? 
why won't you let me do your makeup for once? Because I'm not a girly girl like you. I am not a girly girl. Besides, at least I have a social life. And at least I have friends. The only friend you have is that dumb book. And you haven't put it down since you got it. Well, pardon me for having an education. You call reading books all day an education? My friends and I call that Loserville. Do you want me to drop you off? How would you know the way, Paris? Is that the way you came from? Oh, please, Lisa. Oh, please, Lisa. You couldn't break my claw if you tried. Go ahead and laugh now. Oh, hey, Lisa. What is it? Are you going to prom this year? Uh, I haven't really put much thought into it. Ah, so you don't have a date. What? I never said that. It's okay. They're hard to get. Oh, and what? You're saying you have one? As a matter of fact, I do. Who? Rick Hound, the most hottest and popular guy in school. He asked me out yesterday. Isn't it great? Only in your dreams would Rick Hound ask you out. <laughs> Suit yourself, you loner. So intense! I can't believe he asked her out! Oh my goodness! Uh, Lisa? Can I talk to you for a minute? They would make the cutest couple ever! Oh, uh, hey Rick! Hey Lisa, I uh, kinda wanted to ask you something. <laughs> What's that? Well, you know how prom's coming up? And I thought that, you know, maybe I can go with somebody else, like you. G -g -g going to p p prom with me? This, this isn't a joke, right? Of course not. I never kid around. Oh, then this is real? You're actually asking me to prom? This is... This is amazing! It is, isn't it? <laughs> I'm blushing. <laughs> Alright, well, pick you up at 8, okay? Uh huh, uh huh. Okay, well, uh, bye! He's gone, he's gone, okay. Out of the way, clear. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! You're what? Isn't it exciting? I'm going to prom! You weren't, like a week ago! I know I wasn't, but then a certain somebody asked me. Who in the might... Who in the right mind would? Uh, uh, who in the right mind would? You didn't want me going to prom. Because you, since you thought I wasn't going to prom, you lied about your date. You said you were going to go with Rick. But guess what, toots? He asked me out. So ha ha ha. There is no way on the planet we call our home that he asked you out. Fine, believe it. At least I have a date. What? I have a date? And his name just happens to be Rick. Maybe that's why you got confused. Uh-huh, sure. Oh, see? There he is right now. Hey, baby. Oh, hey, Paris. Uh, come here, Rick. Oh, you got 
got your lip gloss all over me. Oh, uh, sorry, Rick. Uh, the name's Lauren. Ha! You were mine! Oh! Uh, so, uh, Lisa? I had a lot of fun tonight. Yeah, same here. managed to get our own house. Yeah, we did. I love you. I love you too. Rick, I have some news to tell you. What's that, my dear? It looks as if I am. Pregnant. Oh, that's amazing. She's beautiful, honey. She's got your eyes. She got your ears. She is a beautiful child. We've done good. Couldn't say it any better. Honey, can you get that? I'm trying to make dinner. I'm a little busy over here. Can't you do it? My hands are full. Please, Rick. It isn't my child. Yes, it is. Take care of it yourself. I'm tired from work. I have a job. I, the one who keeps a roof over our head. And you think I do nothing? I do the cooking, I do the cleaning, I change the baby's diapers when she needs it. And don't bring up that whole job crap. I couldn't get a job anyway. We can't afford to hire a babysitter. I'm tired of you treating me like I do nothing to this house. I'm out of here. Fine. Leave our marriage. Leave your kid. That's fine. That kid didn't mean anything to me anyway. Mimi? Rick? Paris? My child. My ex-husband. My sister. Autumn Hastings, Autumn Hastings. Number 45, Autumn Hastings. Oh. Autumn Hastings, front and center. Awesome. Please go with my friend Bonnie and tell her what you'd like to be done. Oh, all right, thank you. <laughs> Cool, you go to my school. Oh, hey Bonnie. I didn't know you worked at a hipster salon. <laughs> I just got the job yesterday. Now come on, silly. Coming. Now, what would you like to be done? Well, there was this really cool hairstyle that I just saw a couple weeks ago that I've been dying to have. But at the same time, Maybe I should get my highlights retouched and my split ends cut off. So, you want to be lighter? Not too, not too light, but light enough where you can tell that I got my fur dyed. Okie dokie, artichokey. Now come with me to the shower station. I think I made the right decision. Now, I would like you to please have a seat on the blue chair right there. Oh, uh, this one? Okay, goody goody! Now, just turn around and lie down so your head is over the shower. Okay, turn around and lie down. Perfect! Now, I'm just gonna shampoo and condition your hair so it's clean. Okay.
Okay, now I'm gonna take you to the drying chamber where your dye will totally show up in your fur. Okay, sounds easy. Do I just uh, step inside? Yes, and I'll set the timer for 45 minutes. 45? That's a lot for just a little lighten up. See you in 45 minutes. Do, 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 do. She's gonna look so pretty. Oh my dog, I'm gonna be so jealous of her. <laughs> All right, hon, you can come out now. Oh my goodness, hon, you look gorgeous. Does it look good? Do you really think so? Christy, you look marvelous. Her boyfriend is gonna be so jealous. Oh, Christy, the guys will be all over you. Now come to check out. <gasps> it pays to be pretty. I'm so pretty. Oh, she's done. Okay. Oh my goodness, you are drop dead gorgeous. Come on, come on, no peeking. Okay, I'm coming. I'm actually pretty curious of what I look like. Oh no. Aren't you gorgeous? <laughs>